And she was in Heat 2, I beg your pardon. She finished second in Heat 2, though. So we'll keep you updated on what came about there. But Jordan Malloy finished first. It would be Mihai Loba who finished second. But right now, that her time is is listed as a DNF. So if that's revised, we'll let you know. We, we have had some revisions throughout the day. But uh, that's, a, that's something to keep an eye on because either Mihai Loba will be in and Victoria Lombardi, who is that last finisher, will be out. Or Lombardi's in and Mihailova is out. And that's just the way things go as far as the final is concerned. Oh, we are now underway in the men's 1,500 meters. And we talked about sort of a goal time. And I, I think that you're probably looking at uh, maybe a 405 here. What do you what do you see? Yeah, I would say 405 to even 410, obviously. A right. little bit slower than what you would see in a final. Um, they're just looking to get that big cue. Um, and, and as we see right now, we have CCSU and Wagner out front. Three wide, actually. Um, which can get a little messy, obviously. You don't want to be running in lane two. So um, definitely CCSU's Ryan McCauley should definitely um, tuck in as soon as he can, which I think he's doing. We have CCSU's Tim Lautenbach, um, who finished in third place, actually, in a really thrilling 3,000 meters indoor. Um, so he's right. looking to find his place in the final as well today. And, Angie, you're somebody who's got quite a large array of distances that you ran across your, your college career from the – you were telling me you came in as an 800 runner and you ran, you know, uh, 5Ks and 10Ks. And most runners, though, have a sweet spot where they'll they'll try to focus on two or three events, I think. Though, yeah, right? yeah. They're, yes, I, and that's what coaches will usually recommend. Um, obviously, championship race is a little different. Um, right. We just like to stack up. Um, but right, a lot of a lot of athletes, specifically when you get down to you know 800, 1500 even and below, mm -hmm. that's kind of where you focus on you know a few right. a few races. Um, and it looks like we have a Stonehill um, athlete who's out front right now. That would be Connor Hughes. Connor Hughes okay. He's the lone Stonehill runner in Heat One. He posted a time of four minutes. Point six seven. They are announcing the times now on the women's side for the 1500 meters. We'll keep you updated on what that ends up looking like, whether or not Mihai Lova is in or or not. And I think that that could play a big role tomorrow because she was a real competitor to win yeah, the definitely. event. Definitely. She and Ashley Dana were thought to have two of the best times coming in but if she's not eligible then that would be a that would be big she's not listing the results right now so the question is either they will be updated and she will be or she is actually a dnf because of some sort of a technicality that she did not fulfill throughout that race as they come down to the final lap here is right around 308 in that final split and it's it's a group of four up front, and you, you want to be top four. You'd really want to be top three, and now we see a move from Luke Cunningham down the stretch there to make sure he pulls into top three and does not leave anything to question. I believe that's CCSU Ryan McCauley, who is closing very, very hard um, to kind of look for his spot in the final um, coming off of the end of this, this top pack. So it's Connor Hughes from Stonehill, one. Neil Wettelier from Merrimack, he's in second. And then you've got Luke Cunningham in third. And the question is, who's going to finish in fourth here? Looks like it was Merrimack. you a, a number on, on the runner on who that may have been. Connor Hughes did finish in first. We saw Neil Letelier in second. So that was probably Ryan Dyer then in that. Ryan Dyer, yeah, unless it was it was Will ba Ballard, who was also okay, from, yep. from Merrimack. We're going to have to give you the runner and who that was. Want to make sure we get that right. Okay, yep. It was, Ryan, was Dyer. Ryan Dyer. It was Ryan Dyer in fourth. So, Little yeah, those, those top three, eight, obviously. Right. 
um, will definitely find their place in the final. So just to give you an idea of, of where the times stand right now, Letta Lear first.